a high over the Tasman Sea will move northeast and weaken over the next few days. An upper trough over eastern Queensland will move east and weaken as it moves out of the state this morning. A surface trough developing over western and central Queensland will weaken into a broad trough over southern and central Queensland today. The trough will move east on Wednesday and Thursday, pushing offshore early on Friday morning. A new ridge will extend across the state from Thursday in the wake of the trough. A high will cross southern Australia next Sunday and Monday, maintaining the ridge, forecast for the rest of Tuesday for Queensland, scattered to widespread showers in central, southern, and eastern districts, tending to rain southeast of Townsville to Cunnamulla. A chance of a thunderstorm about the central and northern coasts and nearby inland areas. Isolated to scattered showers over Cape York Peninsula and the Torres Strait. Rainfall in central and southern districts contracting to the east of Longreach by the afternoon. Partly cloudy elsewhere, for New South Wales, showers or rain in many parts of the state, more frequent across the northeast and the central and northern inland. Showers or rain clearing from the west through the day. Daytime temperatures near or slightly below average. North to northeasterly winds, tending light and variable in the far west. For southern and central western Australia, a moderate cold front moved through the southwest land division overnight. On Wednesday the remnants of the cold front will continue to move east over southeastern parts of the state. A cold and gusty, showery westerly flow will then continue across the south for the remainder of the week. Meanwhile, a ridge developing through the Gascoigne on Wednesday will slowly move south towards the end of the week with showery and windy conditions easing, showers over the southwest land division, western and southern Gascoigne, goldfields, Cape Range and the Pilbara.